what does it mean to contribute to the first sellout for men's basketball since 2016? Yeah, I mean, it's a big deal. Uh, super excited for the team. Uh, you know, it's what, seven years since they've had a sellout. So anything to do to help the guys. There's a good group of seniors that are on the team. So glad to help out coach the players. So proud to be a part of it. And why was it important for you to give back and donate tickets? t-shirts and other resources to help the community and University of Hawaii. Well, what people don't understand is that I fell in love with sports at Lower Campus. And so I was very fortunate. I had the resources to come to games. You know, I lived in Manoa. I could ride my bike down and catch games whenever. A lot of these people are just, you know, uh, underprivileged and they live out far. So for them to be able to come out and see potentially what is their first game, you know, maybe there's the future, you know, some who's in the crowd and this will inspire them to, you know, work for UH, attend UH, and maybe even play for UH. What will you remember the most about this particular senior class? I mean, just great kids, uh, the local ties, salute to staying home, and just being a part of this program for six, seven years now. And then Kamaka coming from Texas back home, he has the Hawaii ties, and Juan, just a good kid who I've got to know over the last few years, and just, you know, proud of these guys, and, you know, just good kids, and so happy to help them out and help them celebrate it well, like real winners. How does it feel to have contributed to the first men's basketball sellout since 2016? Oh, what an amazing feeling and so great for the players and for the coaches. They worked so hard to get here. So just so appreciative to be a part of this moment with them. And as far as what you know about this senior class, maybe if you want to share some words about what makes it so special this year. Well, they have the talent, they have the togetherness, they have the teamwork, they're all selfless. You can see it on the court, right? They're not trying to be stars. They're trying to help each other to, to get past each game. And, they, and again, they, that selfless spirit is really what builds their team and what, what attracts other players to play with them. So this is their best year. Right? This is a year where they have the greatest talent they've ever had in club history. And it's a reflection of not just the players, but also the coaches. But that's Coach Kanat and his entire coaching staff and the culture that they create. And with everything that's going on, you know, obviously you do. You brought them into Center Nines, of course, but you also really contributed to giving back for this game in particular, helping with the t-shirts that 3,000 fans are getting and helping the students to get some pizza, courtesy of Giovanni Pastrami. I mean, what made you want to really help out and give back for this, this well, day? Let me start by saying Mike Kawazoe made all this happen. And he is a one of a kind. And because we have people like Mike Kawazoe in the community, we're all able to be here and be a part of this moment. So thank you to Mike Kawazoe and the Wakimalia Hotel for always being one step ahead for everybody to embrace these kind of experiences.